Hey Cancer, welcome to Good Witch Intuitive Tarot. Thank you guys for liking, sharing, and subscribing. Much appreciated, guys. All right, this is going to be your reading for the month of March 2020. can't believe we're in March already. This is crazy. Anyway, Cancer, any for anyone with Cancer placements or anyone else who needs this reading, Spirit and Angels, anyone for the highest good please send through the most important messages they need to hear for the people that need them the most that will be guided to watch this reading on youtube march 2020 or any other time they're guided here and meant to see this reading and resonate with it Whew, deep breath for cancer that was a good breath too wow i just took the deepest most relaxing breath okay cancer what does Cancer need to know here, please? What's up for, with Cancer for the month of March 2020? All right, not feeling successful. What, Cancer? Come on. Why? What's going on here, please, for Cancer? Cancer, 2020, March, the, the whole month. Ooh. Wow, that's weird how they, wow. Oh my goodness, you come in not being successful and then you manifest in the Ten of Pentacles? Wow, all right. What else? This might not be you that's not successful. This might be someone else. All right, give me some more, please, for Cancer. Confusion. Oh, okay, that's why you don't feel successful. You're confused. All right. Oops. Too many. Can we just get one more card for Cancer, please? Too many. Just one or two, please. One or two for Cancer for the month of March 2020. What's most important here for Cancer? Whoa, you got cards flying out on my computer and everywhere else. Just one card for Cancer here, please. Just one. All right, we got two, but let me see. I don't want to mess up the way they came out. This one came out first in reverse, and so did the Queen of Swords. She came out like a challenge on her side so that's interesting all right well let's keep going what else do we need to know for cancer oh gosh and the tower wow something's happening something's going down all right let's see month of march for cancer oh yeah okay so we're looking back here i'm going back just a little bit Yeah, we do have um, a couple of threes here in the past. So, you know, we always have to keep in mind there could have been third party. We do have three of wands reversed, not moving forward. Three of pentacles, then deciding to work on something. Wheel of fortune stuck, not moving forward. Um, high priestess in reverse, secrets coming out, and the hanged man trying to look at things from another perspective here. But not feeling very successful as we come into the reading with the six of wands. But you're steadily manifesting in your Ten of Pentacles. Look at the Magician almost pointing at the Ten of Pentacles. Like, pointing up and manifesting it, but like wanting to manifest this Ten of Pentacles. Uh, fi financial fulfillment, fulfillment in home and family, whatever it is. For each of you, it will probably be whatever you consider your foundation to be. All right, let's move over here. And with the Queen of Swords coming out as a challenge, she almost came out reversed. She was kind of sitting just like that. Um, a little bit more reversed than in the upright, so I felt like she was a challenge. Um, this could be your own energy of, you know, really um, needing to cut people out, really needing to see things clearly. I feel like there's a lot of confusion and illusions with the Seven of Cups here, and you're not really... You're needing to see things clearly and you're not, you are balancing out, juggling a decision that you need to make here. Um, you were feeling very defensive, but you're letting that go. Um, you were nurturing something, you're not nurturing it anymore. And then the tower comes down. So I feel like whatever decision you make is going to bring down the tower. Like, um, I almost feel like you're not going to put any more work into something. This can also be, I'm not moving forward when it's reversed. 
So, you know something here won't be successful and you want to manifest somewhere else. I feel like you're, the magician is pointing that way because it's like, look, this whatever this thing was I had in the past wasn't successful, so I'm manifesting elsewhere. But when I let them know that, the tower is going to come down. All right, but let's get right into it. Let's find out what is this going on. We're going to use um, the Wheel of the Year. This is uh, Modern Spellcasters, the one we just used. All right, this is going to be Wheel of the Year. <clears throat> Spirit and Angels, anyone for the highest good for this Cancer reading. Please help me clarify the cards that we've already laid down here for the month of March 2020 or whenever anyone is guided to this reading. For Cancer or anyone with Cancer placements, please help us clarify cards that we already have laid down here please bring through the most important messages for the people that need them the most that will be guided here uh, this can resonate with anyone who's guided to it really all right why is six of wands reversed here for march 2020 for cancer reading why is six of wands reversed six of wands why is it reversed here cancer reading Okay, I see it. I see it. Wow, you won't believe this. Six of Wands reversed again. All right, give me more. Cancer reading. Why is Six of... Whoa, way too many. Why is Six of Wands reversed here for the Cancer reading? Queen of Swords. All right. I don't know what that means. That she's here too. Okay, why is Queen of Swords here with the Six of Wands reversed for Cancer reading? I feel as though some, somebody could be blocking you. King of Swords. Not. Nah, this is all about your lack of clarity. You need to have this. You aren't seeing things clearly. You're feeling completely unsuccessful here. And you're being told, listen, get some clarity on this. Because right now you have no clarity on this situation. Which is what I felt with this Queen of Swords being the block. You're being told to grab onto your... Queen of Swords. Everybody has a Queen of Swords in them. It's that moment of truth and clarity. And sometimes we need to cut people out. And sometimes we need to um, just speak our truth. Whether it hurts people or not. Whether it brings down a tower or not. Alright, give me one on the King of Swords reverse. Queen of Swords and the Six of Wands reverse. Give us more on this. Yep, absolutely. Look at that. A ton of stress with the Ten of Swords in reverse. We're dumping the stress. Possibly about this fire sign woman or man who's been showing up in everybody's reading. And there's been secrets around it. Okay, interesting. So we're going to get one on that fire sign person. Give me one on the Queen of Wands reversed. Why is the Queen of Wands reversed here, Cancer? Somebody's healing. Yep. Somebody didn't have clarity around something about this woman. And they're trying to get clarity and they're trying to heal. Let's look at um, the magician. Why is the magician here? Now, that woman could also be a man. Queen of Wands can be gender neutral. Okay, so that could be a, just as easily a King of Wands. Somebody does not feel good about something that happened between them and this person and they're healing. There were secrets. There was betrayal. All right, let's look at the Magician. Why is the Magician here for this Cancer reading? March 2020. Eight of Wands. No forward movement. Not No communication. Somebody is manifesting their way away from this, I feel. Give me the Ten of Pentacles here. Cancer reading. Why is Ten of Pentacles here? Absolutely. There's that. Um, is this the Emperor? Yeah. So this is the Emperor in reverse. That very well could be the same person as the Queen of Wands. It's reversed. And here we go. Beautiful. Cancer's getting a new beginning and it's gorgeous. You're in the upright. The Ace of Wands is in the upright. And so is the Ten of Pentacles. Somebody was trying to negatively control this situation. They betrayed you. You're healing from it. They... There were secrets involved, and it held back your forward movement. 
right. But you're manifesting in a beautiful new beginning. And this person could have been doing... Um, I want to also look at this Seven of Cups here. Why is the Seven of Cups here? Cancer reading. Why is Seven of Cups here? Seven of Cups. What's going on here? Cancer reading. March 2020. Oh my God, justice in the upright, beautiful. Listen, here's what I feel, and my face is itching so bad for you guys, which means spirit is here tickling the heck out of my face. So there's something going on here you guys have to listen to whenever this happens. And oh my gosh, I'm just on fire with my face itching like crazy. This always means please listen closely to what's being said. All right, you feel totally unsuccessful because you're not seeing things clearly. Something's going on here where you're being given a brand new beginning. Balanced, beautiful, and just. You just don't know it. I think you're confused. There could be something going on here where you something was being hidden from you because the moon's involved. Or it's something that just wasn't clear. All right, let's look at this Two of Pentacles reversed here. Why is it reversed for this Cancer reading? What's this Two of Pentacles reversed about? The wheel absolutely so here it is you got the this is like karmic justice whatever is going on here when this wheel turns it's your justice karmic justice coming in they're both in the upright they're both very positive why um i almost feel like because of the juggling going on it's like you could be feeling so stuck in your healing from what was happening to you. Oh my gosh, I'm itching like crazy. All right, let me get nine of wands reversed. Why is it here for cancer? I got to get through your reading fast because for some reason I am just being tortured to give you specific messages and it itches so bad. All right, um, nine of wands reversed. Why is it here for cancer? Nine of wands reversed. Absolutely. Look at it. Ace of Pentacles. Ace of Wands. Ace of Pentacles. Justice. The Wheel. Your days of this horrible treatment where you felt like you were a caged animal having to defend yourself. They're done. Absolutely. Oh my gosh. I am itching so bad, Cancer. Alright. Queen of Swords as a challenge. Why is it here? Queen of Swords as a challenge. done. If this person was a challenge to your situation, that is completely done. Death card, done. I also feel like this was about the lack of clarity you have. That's done. The lack of clarity is over with. All right, let's get into the um, Seven of Pentacles reversed. Why is it here for Cancer? Seven of Pentacles reversed. Absolutely, my gosh. Wow. Look at that beautiful judgment card. That is like an aha moment. Some kind of information is coming forward. Ah, that's what I see right there. Something that is going to be amazing. I got to get on this tower. Why is this tower here, please, for the cancer reading? Why is it here? Whoa! Just had a card go flying across the room. This king of cups fell out in the reverse. We're going to see if he comes back out. I'm not taking him because he flew on the floor. All right. Why is that could be a Scorpio man. That's a Scorpio man. Give me one more on the tower, please. Why is the tower here? 
the Knight of Wands came out. Let me get one more on it. Why is the tower here, please? Why tower? Cancer reading. Why is the tower here? Tower for cancer. March 2020. Why is the tower? Okay, I see it. I see it. King of Cups again. Wow. This time he's in the upright, though. All right. Give me one more on the tower with the King of Cups and Knight of Wands. What's going on here for Cancer? We need full clarity on this. This is like some kind of something coming in for you. Some kind of, I feel some kind of message. Give me more. Also is forward movement. What's happening here? The tower, the King of Cups, the message. Wait, that did not come out the right way. The Tower, the King of Cups, and the Knight of Wands. Give me more on this. Why is this tower here for Cancer? March 2020, please. Cancer reading. Tower for Cancer. Why is it here? March 2020. Oh my gosh, my face is itching. Cancer, you are the first sign to tear up my face like this spirit wants you to know something i don't itch like this for no reason this is going crazy right now nine of pentacles some kind of news is coming in for you i feel like it's about something financial ace of pentacles nine of pentacles i feel like something's coming forward it's gonna shock you it's like i almost feel like this is like ah, uh, like a good tower Okay, something about this this judgment card here. I want to know what this Queen of Swords as a challenge is about. Give me more about this Queen of Swords as a challenge here for Cancer. Why is this Queen of Swords a challenge? Yeah, again, you were going deep, looking within. You almost became an icicle. You were in hangman state for so long that you almost became an icicle here. Frozen, looking at things, people, places, everything from a different perspective, even perspective, even inside yourself. This is a very spiritual time. You're coming out of it now. Now you're seeing things and people in places more clearly. You had a lack of clarity. This is all about the end of a lack of clarity for you. There's going to be forward movement here where you were not moving forward before. Forward movement, King of Cups. If you're a man... This could be about you moving forward as a single person very abundantly. This is not a, this is a beautiful card, Nine of Pentacles. This is about you moving forward as a single person, but in a confident, very secure manner, very abundant. Same thing if you're a woman, but there is a King of Cups here involved. And he did pop out reversed before, and then he came out in the upright. Why is this King of Cups here with the tower, please? Why? For Cancer? Why is the King of Cups here with the Tower for Cancer? Knight of Pentacles Reverse. Something that came in super, super slow. Whatever this was, was moving so slow, and all of a sudden, it's going to arrive. And it seems to be, I want one more on the um, King of Cups. Can I have one more on the King of Cups with the Tower? What is this? Why is the King of Cups involved with the Tower? This could be a Scorpio man for some of you. Why is the King of Cups involved with this tower? What's this mean for Cancer? No, nope, too many. Just one or two, please, for Cancer. I see it. High Priestess, secrets are coming out. Give me one on the tower with the King of Cups. What is this with the High Priestess reverse? What are the secrets about? And what's it got to do with the King of Cups in the tower? Just one, please. Oh, no, no, no. It's all falling. Darn it. All right. What were these? Okay. These are all messed up now, guys. Hold on. We're just going to redo the whole thing. All right. King of Cups with the Tower with the High Priestess Reverse. Queen of Pentacles Reverse. So, I mean, I'm sorry, Princess of Pentacles. So now we have the Knight and the Queen of Pentacles both in reverse. I feel like whatever this is, they're just saying it was a long time coming. It was a long time coming. It was a long time coming. 
Why are the pentacles reversed? Why is the knight of pentacles and the princess of pentacles reversed here with the tower? Why? It's divinely guided. All right, so we have someone here who was unable to walk away. Eight of cups reversed. This is divinely guided, though. Why is temperance here with the eight of cups in reverse? This is someone who was stuck. All right, there's going to be forward movement here suddenly. Give me more. Oh, absolutely. There was something sneaky and shady that went down. Seven of swords, but now it's it's out. It's in the open. It's Somebody felt like they couldn't even leave their house. Something sneaky and shady was going on. Something happened here. It could have to do with the home, the house, something. Um, give me one on the Seven of Swords reversed here. Seven of Swords reversed, please. Seven of Swords reversed, please. Why is it here? Seven of Wands reversed. Someone who felt like they had to protect themselves, guard themselves. Like I said, they felt like they couldn't leave the house. Now that's, I think that's um, getting dropped now. Give me another one on the temperance with the eight of cups reversed. Why? I want to know why this is divinely guided here. Why is the temperance with the eight of cups here to reversed, divinely guided? Why is it divinely guided? Because it's wish fulfillment. Wow. Okay. Well, wow. It's someone who's going to get out of their head, out of the stress, out of feeling trapped with the Eight of Swords reverse, about a partnership, Two of Cups, and it's going to be wish fulfillment. Whatever this was that stressed you out, I feel like someone felt like they couldn't even leave their home. Uh, sneaky, sh shady stuff. It's all being exposed here. It was a very long time coming. It might have to do with something about a Scorpio man and secrets coming out. Could be about money. Um, but I don't know. I mean, it could be about a cancer man, obviously. Can I get one more just on the tower, please? What is this event for cancer? For cancer men and women. I want to know what the tower is for cancer men and women. Six of cups reversed. It has to do with an unhappy past. One more, please. Unhappy family. Or just a plant. And sometimes the Ten of Cups isn't about, oh my gosh, my face is itching again like crazy. My nose is going nuts. Unhappiness in general. Sometimes it's not always about a family, but it could be. It very much could be. Unhappy past, unhappy family situation. Give me one more on this tower for men and women, for cancers. Yes, the, this could have to do with depression and unhappiness around a home, a family could have involved, oh my gosh, a Scorpio, a Leo. We've got the full card here, something moving forward, and we got someone moving on to peace, Six of Swords. See all these daggers coming at their back? They're going to get out of there just in time to get to a peaceful place and not get hit by any more daggers. Something happened. I know this was hard. I wanted to dig into this tower really good. This is some kind of something coming out about a home, a family, a situation that was just plain old unhappy. Could have had to do with a Scorpio or a Leo or a Cancer. Um, there was a lot of male energy here. There was also Sagittarius energy here. So keep that in mind. I do feel like... I feel like whatever this is that's coming out is going to be clarity brought in. A lot of clarity coming in. These are all cards of clarity, and these are just the ones that are down here. Oh, don't forget judgment, too. These are all cards of clarity coming in. The Queen of Swords was the challenge to clarity, like, but that's coming to an end. The, the challenge to the clarity here is coming to an end. There's clarity coming in, and the King uh, or the Queen of Swords here is clarity coming in. Something about secrets around a fire sign woman. I think that there's a Leo involved, that there were secrets around, there was betrayal, someone's healing, uh, someone absolutely is not feeling very good about this, there's been no forward movement whatsoever, and then all of a sudden, uh, well, we do have this reversed emperor here too, this could be that same 
fire sign male or female it could be a team just like it was for yesterday or for what reading was that i want to say could it have been could have been monday's reading could have been monday's reading but either way um Absolutely. There's a new beginning, Ten of Pentacles, for the Queen of Cups. This is you, Cancer ladies. You are you have something phenomenal coming in. Justice, the Wheel, the Ace of Pentacles, the Ace of Wands. Clarity coming in. A decision made. I feel like this could even be financial. Um, absolutely. You're going to see things more clearly. The confusion's coming to complete end totally with some kind of information that brings down the tower but the tower doesn't feel bad to me i'm going to get an after tower card right on that tower okay it might be bad for somebody it definitely doesn't feel bad for cancer women if you're a cancer man it's possible okay so we're gonna get we're gonna clarify it we're gonna clarify it because even for cancer man, men, it could have been a different person that it's not good for, like a Leo or a Sagittarius, especially a Scorpio. Okay, so, but for cancer ladies, you're beaming, you're shining, you're, everything good is happening in your world. All right, spirit and angels, any, anyone for the highest good, what comes next in this situation for anyone that resonated with this situation? Oops. Let me look at the tower. What does the tower mean here? Why is it here? What comes next when it comes to this tower? Hopes, wishes, and dreams coming in. I'm not kidding you. Absolutely. What does the tower mean for just cancer men? Truth and clarity coming in. Absolutely. There's a lot of Aquarian energy here as well, but it looks beautiful. Could I have one card on that um, King of Swords, please, for the cancer men? One card on the King of Swords for the Cancer Men. Oh, come on. One King. Oh, all right. We have someone coming in, kind of having your back, but it came out in a weird way, so I want to get another one. Could we have another card, please, on the King of Swords here for Cancer Men only? Fairness balance now keep in mind you know this could be that you might owe something or someone owes you something we're going to get one more on it one more for the six of pentacles for cancer men with the king of swords yeah we have the emperor and we have the eight of wands so there is something moving forward for you cancer men there is kind of a controlling energy here though but it could just be someone taking control of the situation to bring balance into it and that's really nice so what i want to do is look at um the whole reading for all of you so you guys all look good whatever this is yeah it might be a tower moment that brings balance in for cancer men for ladies it's bringing in justice the wheel the ace of pentacles the ace of wands i mean for for ladies this is like a ten of pentacles moment for you this is something amazing coming in with, for you and it all comes off of reverse emperor so that emperor might have been out of control all right let's um why okay what comes next with that reverse six of wands twice for this cancer reading what comes next for that situation someone's healing from something and look at that the page of pentacles what comes next for the reverse six of wands situation at the very beginning of this reading what was that forward movement okay so all that was about was not that you weren't successful just that no forward movement same thing with eight of wands no forward movement all right, tell us, give us more on this entire reading for anyone that resonated with it. What comes next? Beautiful. Balance is being brought in. No matter what, whether you're male or female, balance is being brought into this situation. Could we have one more that tells us what comes next for anyone that resonated here? Absolutely. Coming together with another person with um, goals that are the same as yours. This, this is just two of wands. It's 
two people that agree on a path to take together. Now, this does not have to be love at all. This feels like it could be very financial here, but we have here making the plans to move forward and then actually bringing the plans into action. Not taking the action yet, but manifesting them in and getting ready to step into them. Absolutely beautiful. Once you step into them, all this beauty comes in here. I don't know why such a um, such a tower had to happen in this situation. I feel as though someone, I almost feel like someone didn't think that these hopes and dreams were achievable here with the Six of Wands reversed twice. And then all of a sudden it's like, bam, justice comes in, the wheel comes in, the new something tangible might very well come in especially since we had this page back here and this six of pentacles i mean this could literally be some money that comes in that was being you know i don't know so you guys have to tell me um if something financial is coming through for you or if i almost feel like a dream you dreamt of that you really weren't sure could ever come in you manifested it in. You brought it in. Three of Wands manifesting. The Magician manifesting. The Magician has been manifesting in Ten Pentacles. And it almost looks as if you get them, you know? Absolutely beautiful. You guys have to let me know. All right. For anyone that resonated with this reading, for the Cancer reading for March 2020, what do you want them to focus on, please, angels? What? One more. Tenderness, patience, and play. Wow. This is, there has been patience because like I said, this was a long time coming. This was a long time coming. Tenderness. Give yourself a break. This is always for me when I see tenderness, it's about self-love. And have some fun when I see play or joy or any of the other cards that are like these cards. I feel like somebody's not been having enough fun in their life. They've been kind of stuck, not enjoying life. Can I have one more for cancer? Wow, my favorite card in this deck, the abundance card. Abundance is coming in for you, cancer. Abundance is coming in. Your patience is paying off. Give yourself a break. Pamper yourself and play have fun in life it's time it's time anyway guys please let me know if this was your reading i'd love to know how this played out for each of you i'd love to know about this tower moment it feels like a positive tower moment it feels divinely guided in so many ways this is the karmic wheel the divine brings in this wheel this is the judgment card in the upright aha moment that beautiful awakening that beautiful ah uh, it's like a something amazing coming in tell me if this is your reading guys i hope it resonates with you i hope that this is something that you manifested in that's going to bring justice and balance into your life okay guys thanks so much for checking me out if you need a personal reading my information's right below this video in that little description area if you don't see it just comment down below tell me you're looking for a reading but if you check out the description area you'll see the prices you'll also see an amazing special that i've been running that has been going over huge it's an awesome deal anyway guys let me know okay talk to you soon bye